Hey, Molly here from MCI. I'm just going to give you a quick tour through the eCampus before you get started with your course. eCampus is an online learning portal where you can find your course material, submit assessments or have discussions with other students. Now let's jump in so you can start your study with MCI Institute. First, you're going to want to log in. You can do this on the MCI Institute homepage by clicking on the eCampus login on the top toolbar. It's a good idea to bookmark this page because you'll be coming here a lot. Don't worry if it doesn't look like this. The login page can sometimes look different. Be sure to have your eCampus login details, that's your username and password, ready to go. If you run into any issues, you can chat to our support staff in the Let's Chat window in the bottom right hand corner. Once you're logged in, you'll be looking at My Desk. My Desk gives you access to your course and other resources. I suggest you check out the LLN Assistance course and the Study Skills tips. You can explore eCampus by using the navigation on the left window pane. Take the opportunity to update and edit your profile. You can add a profile picture, tags and details about yourself. If you're looking to share your learning, why not introduce yourself and start a new discussion thread? The forums are a really good way to find a study buddy if you want to connect with someone other than your mentor. Now you can access your course page. For me, that's Diploma of Business. This is your course page where you'll find all your units of study. You'll see a bunch of references to our immersive learning program called WAMCO. We'll explain all about that when you get stuck into your units. Firstly though, I suggest you explore the MCI orientation course. Here you'll find information on study management, technology skills and digital literacy. This is so handy, especially if it's been a while since you last studied. The orientation is just a refresher to get you back up to the speed of learning. You're now ready to explore your first unit of study, so let's jump in. This is where you'll find your course documents. These include information about your assessment tasks and links to upload your portfolio files for grading. All grading is based on competency. That means you'll submit your work until you're deemed competent. Your assessments might come back from time to time with feedback for you to make a few adjustments, and that's okay. Give it another shot and resubmit until you reach the competent grade. Always remember though, your mentor is there to help you and guide you through it. There's just one last thing I need to point out that really shouldn't need pointing out. This giant red button is what you need to hit if you need support at any time. If you haven't been assigned a mentor or you just need some help, give this button a press. That's a really quick overview of your eCampus. As always, get in touch with us if you're having any trouble. You're now ready to start working through your course. Good luck.